You're halfway. Sweet Tooth Cheryl sailed through the invention test but struggled in the pro kitchen. She now needs to deliver when it really counts. What two dishes are you cooking with? I'm doing pan fried pollock with, on a bed of um, wilted spinach with a watercress and lime sauce and sauté potatoes. And then for pudding, I'm doing a ginger, chocolate and creme fraiche mousse with honeycomb twill. Is the lime, the addition of that lime, because of your heritage? Yes, partly, because I feel that it just gives it a sort of a slightly different twist. What do you think is the most difficult part of your two courses today? Just getting the timing right, because, you know, making sure that everything's ready on time, particularly with the main course. And you're confident? Yes, confident. Wait to get into her chocolate and ginger mousse with the honeycomb twill. That sounds absolutely fantastic. Lots of skill going into it. You have five minutes left. Step away from the bench, please. Home cook Kim is serving spring lamb with potatoes and a vegetable medley, followed by raspberry and passion fruit cheesecake. That lamb is cooked beautifully and it's full of flavour and I get traces of mint coming off of the rub around the outside, which is absolutely heavenly. I think there are a couple of too many ingredients. I think those, the asparagus is just too much and I don't think it needs a tomato. I really, 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 really like that dish. Thank you. Lamb out. Cheesecake in. <laughs> it goes wah up there with the raspberries. It goes down there with the sweet passion fruit. It's lovely. The flavours of your cheesecake deliver are absolutely right. Ginger biscuits underneath, the soft, sweet cream. It is really lovely. As with all my cooking, things are simple, but they're tasty. Pudding lover Cheryl has cooked pollock with a watercress and lime sauce and potatoes, followed by a chocolate, ginger and creme fraiche mousse with honeycomb twill. Your fish is cooked beautifully. Your potatoes can do a little bit more salt and pepper on them. Mm -hmm. The watercress flavour has not come through as well as it could have. I really want to like it. It's not a great dish, Cheryl. No. I'm sorry to say. The fish is cooked very, very nicely. The potatoes are a little bit hard in the middle. Mm. I'm absolutely convinced that you are a much, much better cook than this. Let's move on to your dessert. Mm -hmm. The overall flavour is like the most delicious chocolate bar you've ever eaten in your life. It is beautiful. I am quite um, taken aback. It's quite sensational. It just flies away inside your mouth. I mean, you are a real talent. Thank you. And this is what you love to do, Cheryl. You don't ever lose that love, because that is just beautiful. Thank you. I know there's no consolation to two of you, but this has been an extremely tough decision for us. But we do only have one quarterfinal place. Our quarterfinalist. is Cheryl. Congratulations. I can't believe it. I'm just absolutely blown away. It's just incredible. I just can't believe it. It's like, oh my gosh. I'm really pleased and proud of myself just to get this far. If anything, it's just made me more determined to carry on and uh, pursue my dream. It's a real experience. It's actually reinvigorated my passion for cooking. It's made me realise that's what I want to do.